Hey, what's going on guys? DJ has here, collectivekicks.com. Wanted to bring you guys a detailed look and review of the Nike uh, Dunk Highs. And these are the coffin themes from the uh, Halloween kind of pack that they had this last year. I wasn't going to do a review on these shoes until I broke them out and was going to do an on foot video. And then I noticed a lot of details that you do not see on the stock images of these shoes. And I think if I show you some of these things, it will turn a lot of heads and change a little bit of opinions um, based on these shoes. So I definitely liked the images of the shoe at first when we saw the black and kind of this uh, bloody coffin sort of theme was definitely cool and then um, I have to show you the details that made these things jump over the top so uh, box price on these things I think we're what threw people off 120 on the box and it's a dunk uh, comfort PRM QS so it's it's D uh, it's dunk CM FT comfort PRM premium and QS for quick strike but for a quick strike, these things were very widespread. They weren't very limited. Um, that being said, uh, they did not sell out, so you could probably buy them online still. I'll put a link in the description. On uh, Nike and on eBay, you might be able to get them actually cheaper on eBay, uh, which, in my opinion, my recommendation is these are definitely dope. Um, and it's not necessarily a Halloween theme. It, it looks sort of like it, I guess, in a sense, but you could wear these, I mean, pretty much any time. So one of the things that drew me to the shoe originally was this crazy, like, kind of velvet felt uh, back quilted like area and I thought that was a really nice touch to the shoe and you have the patent leather swoosh that goes around and then you have the kind of the bloody gum sole bottoms um, with a black midsole all black upper black laces and these ones are um, the waxed laces as you can see and then also it has this nice little lace lock here with a Nike um, name and then in the uh, form of a coffin and they're not SBs I thought they were SBs but anyway um, but the thing that threw me off and I did not realize is this tongue is satin and I thought that was a really really nice nod to the whole coffin theme you have a satin tongue it's really hard to pick up the, the materials on the camera but this is satin and then this is like the thing that throws it over the top the back the tongue is actually quilted with that um, like velvety suede sort of look as well so that was like holy crap i didn't realize like the inside collar is is quilted but then the back of the tongue is quilted that was like dope so when you put them on they were super super warm super comfortable and then uh i'm looking down here on the bottom and there's actually one other thing that is worth pulling out because um even the insole is that crushed velvet like how sick is that so you get this crushed velvet on the insole um and like it's basically lined like like a coffin would be uh so i thought that was like super dope the way that it's kind of an extra nod to the theme you have the zoom on the bottom of there but it's definitely like a, a nod to the the whole coffin theme it's like black and then like crushed velvet like whatever this stuff is all over in the inside of the shoe and um even down to through the toe box area is, is lined so super super dope really well executed uh, and it's one of those things that sucks that nobody knew about that. I'm pretty sure nobody knew that the inside of this was the velvet as well as a tongue being satin. I mean, that to me was the extra little detail that I, I definitely like to see. And, um, the stock pictures just didn't no justice to these shoes. Uh, I'll put the on foot section so you guys can see what they look like right now. But what do you guys think about these, uh, these shoes? I'm actually really, really pleasantly surprised. Uh, and there's, there's no better feeling to get in a sneaker that doesn't have any hype it's something that you wanted anyway and you just take the leap to buy the shoe because you you liked it and uh and then you see it like there's a whole bunch of other cool things about the shoe that uh, probably nobody else even noticed i love um doing that or loving i love when that type of thing happens and it makes um buying sneakers like so much more fun uh it's kind of like a little easter egg inside the shoe uh itself so that uh that's pretty much the video hopefully you guys liked the video if you guys uh, did not know any of these details leave a comment let me know that you didn't know about them or if you did still didn't change your mind let me know um if you like the shoes or not i'm just curious to see what you guys opinions are uh but the other thing i guess the last part that i will mention is the leather quality on the shoe it was it's not like like earth shattering leather quality it would have been dope if it was really nice tumbled leather or something like that or i mean obviously um the nicer quality leather the better but it, it was just kind of generic plain leather at the end of the day, it's still nice, and uh, I'm definitely really, really stoked on the purchase. Uh, anyway, hope you guys enjoyed. Thank you again for watching, and we'll catch you guys for some more videos soon. Peace, guys.